For decades, an enormous puzzle has challenged people around the world. How to power our homes cheaply and cleanly. But now, a remarkable solution is emerging. Imagine coming home each day and never having to pay an electricity bill again. A lot of people I know have solar. I said, if the grid goes down, does the solar work? And they said, no. I said, well, what's the point? Why do you have solar? Here in California, we have lots of climate events. Imagine a house that quietly generates all its own power, even when the grid goes down. For many families, the monthly bill brings dread and alarm. This new system would silence that, ending the constant reminder of expense. Two pioneering companies are racing to make that vision a reality. Solhide, in Belgium, has developed the Solhide module, a solar panel that produces hydrogen directly from sunlight and air. Meanwhile, H2X Global, an Australian firm, offers a hydrogen fuel cell generator that converts hydrogen into electricity with zero emission. Together, these systems promise to create a seamless, off-grid power solution. Sunlight is captured and stored as hydrogen during the day, then the hydrogen is converted back into electricity whenever it's needed. Recent demo projects in Europe already show this is coming true. The energy context couldn't be more urgent. With global electricity costs climbing and climate concerns mounting, new solutions are essential. These two devices, a hydrogen-producing solar panel and a hydrogen fuel cell, work hand-in-hand -hand to tackle those challenges. Each Solhide panel acts like a solar PV panel fused with an electrolyzer. When sunlight hits the panel, it drives an electrochemical reaction that splits water vapor in the air into hydrogen and oxygen gas. The hydrogen is captured in a storage tank, while oxygen is released harmlessly back to the air. Remarkably, this process requires no liquid water or exotic materials. In ideal sunny conditions, a modest array of Solhide modules can generate hundreds of liters of hydrogen per day enough fuel to keep a home generator running for many hours. These hydrogen-producing panels have already been tested in the field. In Wallonia, Belgium, a new 2-megawatt solar hydrogen park is under construction. It will integrate 50 kilowatts of Solhide modules into a standard solar array. During the daytime, some of the solar energy will be diverted to these panels to make hydrogen. The rest will generate regular electricity. Over the course of a year, this facility will produce both electricity and clean hydrogen fuel from the sun. Solhide's CEO notes, this is a commercially relevant demonstration proving that green hydrogen can be approached in a pragmatic and scalable way, and that by harnessing the sun directly, we lower costs and drastically simplify the system. In short, the solar panel not only powers your home, like any PV panel, it also fills your hydrogen tank for later use. On the other side of the system is the H2X hydrogen fuel cell generator. This device acts like a silent power plant. Hydrogen fuel is fed in, and electricity is produced through a chemical reaction. Inside the fuel cell, hydrogen molecules combine with oxygen from the air. This reaction generates an electric current, along with heat and pure water vapor as harmless byproducts. In fact, with pure hydrogen fuel, the only exhaust is water H2. X Global markets these generators as zero emissions replacement for traditional diesel generators, clean, quiet power units ideal for off-grid use. They're designed for everything from construction sites and farms to backup power for homes. Because fuel cells have no moving parts, the H2X units run silently and reliably as long as hydrogen fuel is. Imagine how they work together. During a sunny day, the SoLHYD panel array produces hydrogen and stores it in tanks. When night falls or clouds roll in, the homeowner switches on the H2X fuel cell generator. The stored hydrogen flows into the generator 
where it is mixed with oxygen and turned into electricity on demand. Throughout this cycle, no fossil fuel is burned and no carbon is emitted. The only input is sunshine, and the only new output is water. In effect, the home has become its own tiny power plant. The sun provides free fuel by day, and hydrogen keeps the lights on by night. Over time, that means you're pulling almost no power from the grid, just replacing it with sunlight stored energy. This setup translates directly into drastic savings. After the initial installation cost of panels, tanks, and generator, the only fuel you use is free sunshine. In practice, homeowners could eliminate most of their electricity bills. Solhide's leadership emphasizes that by capturing solar energy directly in hydrogen, the system cuts costs and simplifies energy supply. A properly sized system could easily meet an average household's needs 24-7, a 5 to 10 kilowatt fuel cell generator, sufficient for home use, can draw from the daytime produced hydrogen. Since the hydrogen is renewable and the sun never sends a bill, the ongoing operating expense is effectively zero. In other words, electricity becomes free forever, aside from maintenance. It's worth noting the physics, too. Each conversion step has some energy loss, Modern photovoltaic cells run around 15 to 20 percent efficient, and fuel cells around 40 to 60 percent efficient. So if you start with 100 units of sunlight, perhaps 8 to 10 units come out as nighttime electricity. However, because the sunlight itself is abundant and free, the system still works out. You might simply install enough solar capacity to cover those losses. Think of it like storing excess summer solar for winter use. Technicians stress that hydrogen storage can solve the intermittency of solar and wind at large scale. It's just another battery, but chemical and long-lasting. The bottom line is that every kilowatt hour you generate from the sun costs nothing. So even with losses, your net cost per kilowatt hour is virtually nil. Safety and practicality are also engineered in. The Solhide panels look and install like normal PV panels. Hydrogen is stored in industrial high-pressure tanks, similar to those used in hydrogen vehicles or refueling stations. The H2X fuel cell unit is a sealed box, about the size of a small cabinet, that vents only water vapor. There's no combustion flame, no noise, and no exhaust fumes. In fact, fuel cells are known to be extremely quiet and reliable. In a home setting, the whole system would operate much like a familiar standby generator setup, only one that runs on clean fuel and never burns out. This means families could have backup power in an outage and never see an electricity meter run backward. These technologies are already emerging from the lab into reality. In Belgium's Solar Hydrogen Park, partners like Solhide and Nippon Gases are proving it on a large scale. In Australia, H2X Global has already sold a 5 kilowatt hydrogen generator to a hydrogen innovation center. The fuel cell approach is also being applied to vehicles and other generators. Each successful deployment drives down costs and shows people it works. The scientific principles are well understood. We're simply combining them in a clever way. The combination of a solar-powered hydrogen generator and a hydrogen fuel cell could truly let homeowners break the chain with their electric utility. It means capturing the abundant solar energy and locking it into hydrogen fuel, then tapping that fuel whenever needed to power the home. The result? round-the-clock clean energy with essentially no electricity bills. As Solhide's CEO says, by harnessing sunlight directly for hydrogen, we can drastically lower costs and simplify the energy system. In a world facing energy shortages and climate change, this synergy of two devices, sunlight, hydrogen, electricity, may offer a transformative path forward. The era of no-bills electricity might not be just a dream, 
but an imminent reality. Many homeowners who install renewable systems find they pay off their investment in only a few years by slashing their utility bills. After that break-even point, every extra year is almost pure savings, and that means the household literally gets free power. To see how practical this is, let's consider some numbers. One kilogram of hydrogen contains roughly 33 kilowatt hours of energy, about what an average home uses in a day. That means producing just one or two kilograms of hydrogen on a sunny day could run a house overnight. One Soel Huaidi panel might produce a liter or two of hydrogen per day in strong sunlight. With a moderate array of dozens of panels, families could easily collect the needed hydrogen each day. In other words, a normal household with a well-sized rooftop setup can meet its energy needs without a single charge from the grid or any delivered fuel. It's like installing a personal power plant fueled by the sun's abundance. Another way to think about it is by analogy. A traditional battery stores power, but can only release it until empty. A fuel cell is like a battery that you refill with fuel, and so it never runs out as long as fuel is supplied. In this case, the fuel is hydrogen made by the sun. It's as if your solar panels charge up an invisible battery of gas and the H2X fuel cell runs on that fuel continuously. This model means you aren't stuck with whatever energy you captured at a single moment. The fuel cell simply runs steadily while gas lasts. In effect, the sun is charging hydrogen that acts like a long-lasting energy bank for your home.